Nothing severe to show you on live Doppler 13 radar, but I am tracking some very heavy rain and I want to give you a closer view of the heavy rain that's near Frankfurt, Cicero, Tipton, Elwood, southeast into Anderson, south to Pendleton, into Greenfield, and all of this tracking slowly off to the east northeast as we put it into motion. You can see some of the heavier rain starting to move into Anderson. Now this holds together. It's headed into Muncie and Newcastle next. Again, no watches or warnings, but the threat for some heavy rain that may lead to some standing water overnight and first thing tomorrow. Rain in Logansport, Monticello, La Lafayette, Fowler and Attica expanding the view on radar. This is a large storm system that extends all the way south into parts of Texas where they have been dealing with severe weather this evening. Future Track 13 doing a pretty good job on the placement of the rain so far and it is forecast to linger overnight. So expect some wet roads out the door on your Thursday and grab the umbrella. The good news overnight and into early tomorrow that severe threat begins to shift to the south. However, we're still going to be in and out of some rain, maybe a few rumbles of thunder tomorrow afternoon. This is midday Thursday. We'll stop it again during the afternoon hours, mid afternoon at 3 p.m. Still tracking some rain. All of this comes to an end later tomorrow night into the early part of Friday, and that will set us up for some sunshine Friday that will carry us into the weekend as well. So the threat for some heavy rain overnight, we're not completely out of the woods in terms of that severe risk, so we'll make sure to keep you updated. Rain and a few thunderstorms tomorrow, 66, so grab the umbrella, then you can put that away and grab the sunglasses. 62, a breezy day and a cooler day on Friday, but the sunshine is back. Sunshine on Saturday, 72, sunshine will give way to increasing clouds a windy day Sunday 80 with more rain and storms early next week.